right now you're below the water table here. So we got a call for a Jeep that's stuck in the mud out here to San Paulo. We're gonna head out there and see if we can get him out. I called Holly and asked her to bring Mischief Maker out since Rudy's still out of town. We're probably gonna need a little help on this. We got Colin back there to swing the camera. All right. And Hefe with the complete weather forecast. Uh, we gotta beat a rainstorm. It's heading in right now, look pretty dark in clouds. It's not too hot, it's starting to cool off, which is nice. This vehicle's buried, and it's gonna be take some work to get it out. Last year, this was solid. <laughs> Never been solid. Well, if the I was lake, driving if the, on it last year, no problem. If the lake's about 100 feet further that way, it would yeah, be. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right now, you're below the water table here. The rule is the white. You always stay off the white. Yeah. Well, thank you. He's gonna go right here? Yeah. So let's get, we'll get Mischief Maker right here. Okay, let's get this rigged up. Oh, there's Mischief Maker. Wow, that's a rig. A friend of mine just was driving, and all of a sudden he just went boom into his axle. Yeah. And we had to have a couple of people with him. Okay. I think so. I think he's going to try and pull both at the same time. you don't mess with jeeps near water <laughs> just don't do it i came out here with a speed the other day that did nothing <laughs> that did nothing but i was trying everything we're gonna have to use some creative rigging that's what we do <laughs> problem solver <laughs> You're real enough for nice. me. I was a little. Well, like a I was questioning you. I had a like question you, about it's you. It's a good time too, Thank right? You. Thanks for using. Hey us. man, no problem. We appreciate well, you. Well, now I'll use you regardless. <laughs> my boot almost no oh, dad's not gonna be happy for those of you that don't know holly and her amazing awesome ride mischief maker she is the wonder woman of the off-road community not really no <laughs> she's she's full on legit so rudy's out of town and holly was in town and she's like hey if you get a call i'll be available to help i'm like heck yeah yeah so that's what we're doing, and George is buzzing us. <laughs> Look at this rig. Anybody want to take care of You're gonna have to be. Okay, give me a medium or a large. Yeah, there's yep. give, give it up. Yep, yep. yep. here it is. Okay, <laughs> sorry, I had to take, We're coming take, out and saving our buns. <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye. Yep. Okay, what was that? Thanks so much. Yep. So while we were there doing that job, another call came in for a razor that the front end's all broken up. So we're gonna head out there and see if we can get it out. Should be a good time. <laughs> oh. 
tag along on this job too? Oh, I'd have to get more propane. I'm almost out. <laughs> My liver. <laughs> we just got done doing one with Holly and George. George should be behind yeah, us. George's right there. We were waving to him. Colt said you tried to kill him in this thing. Oh, I did. I get to be terrified too. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know I was going to be part of a Tokyo drift party coming down there. If that hill had any other kind of terrain around it, it would be a non-issue. Like, it wouldn't be scary. Right so now. we're gonna go get it. Right, I'll, take it easy. I'll try and take. So that was a pretty full afternoon. So we got a call for an F450 camper conversion house heavy thing with a. He says the transmission went out on the Tokerville Falls Road. So we're gonna head up there. We're gonna have to flat tow it down to the pavement. And so I called my friend Holly in. So we're gonna head up there and see if we can get him out. I think it's a little windy, but it sun's out. So if we can find them, we'll get them out for sure. Two big shocks there, and then you look at these little ones over here. <laughs> hey! So I get to ride in Mischief Maker with Holly. This is exciting, and this is her first time going to Tokerville Falls, she says. It is, yeah. I've been here for a little while, but never been to Tokerville Falls. Then I get the call. She got a call. I got a call. Yeah, I'm excited to be here. So you just lost transmission, or is that what you think? Just check the fluid in the actually drowning color and super stinky. With the transmission like that, can you still run the motor and have brakes? I think so. What do you think of the size of that thing, Ed? That's big for up here. So what are your thoughts? Well, it would be fine if I had a tow point in the back, but I don't. I only have one in the front. I forgot to put it in the back. <laughs> I just haven't quite got there yet. <laughs> Okay, flip around and I'll get in front of you and we'll rig this up. fuel tanks on the passenger side on the floor so it's very susceptible okay it's about three feet off the ground right now okay well let's take it nice and slow then is it all you ever hoped for and dreamed of <laughs> <laughs> no it's pretty cool that thing's heavy for sure yeah yeah <laughs> so 
probably down here at the bottom of this. Yeah. So he wasn't lying, huh? What size shirt do you wear? Large. There's one right there. Right. Yeah. What size do you wear? Thank there you. There you go. It's a custom cut tailor. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay. Thank you. So what did you think? Well, I think um, Matt can call me anytime. <laughs> <laughs> right no, that on. was a lot of fun. It was a really heavy vehicle, though. Yeah. Really heavy. Yeah. Going down the hills. Whew. We weren't spinning a tire at all. I had my foot on the brake the entire time, but he's happy. He's getting up. We'll see him at the bottom. And another recovery done with Matt's off road recovery. Well, that was awful heavy and high, tall, tippy. We got him out. Thanks for watching. <laughs>